yo yo what's up people hope you're having a good day or a good night whatever time it is where you are man i just hope you're having a good one so we got some mass go heat for your symphony of horror <laughs> this is nas man and um uh you know what's cool about this like the artwork is really dope like i'm gonna let y'all just sit here and marinate on this artwork real quick man and check this out like check this out the box actually glows in the dark somebody brought this to my attention i was like yeah right but then boom there it was man so check it out uh let's cut these lights off real quick one and two ah you can't even tell hold on one second i'm gonna get this going for y'all look at that look at that glow man that's crazy the box actually glows in the dark you can feel it too this little uh all this glow glowiness is really textured so yeah man just want to show y'all that real quick man that's pretty good so let's go ahead and get these lights back on and get the video started oh oh my goodness we are back at it like some type of drug addict <laughs> but this time it's figures <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just playing, man. Look at Nas, man. Dang. All the detail. The red eyes. The little, the pink across the ears. The black shading on his eyes. The blue veins in his head. The little Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer red on his nose. The two buck teeth right there for sucking all the blood. The egg head. Look at the, look at the shape of the head right there, man. There's so much detail. Nas is just packing so much detail, man. And I gotta admit, um, that gray is looking really good with that red like it's looking really it's looking really good with that red man like that's that's straight like that's i'm gonna give that one star off the bat that's one star right there so that red and gray looks really good so let's look at the articulation in the neck though all around all around he can see his victims no matter which way his victims go or run Nas is looking at his victims all the way so let's see is this cape or not cape is this like uh this collar wired the collar is not wired but i want to tell you guys something man because you can't tell but this um his top it feels really good like real high quality stuff right there man so as far as the t pose goes you got to be careful because you're going to be restricted by the limitations of the soft goods all right so the articulation is there but the soft goods get in the way okay so the bicep cut is where i'm trying to feel for it because i can't see it let's see give me a second and you're probably wondering, oh, why you don't know? Well, because this is my first time opening it and I don't really, my reviews or my videos kind of like unscripted. I don't feel a bicep swivel at all. Like it's not, it's not going. There's no bicep swivel there. Well, there's some shoulder pads right there. That's cool. He's been doing his shrug workout. All right, cool. So we're going to just rotate in. We're going to rotate all right there. It looks like, okay. All the rotation is going to be right there in his forearm. And you are, I think we are double jointed, but again, we have to watch out for the soft goods. Are we single jointed? No, we are single jointed. My bad. We are single jointed. It's going to stop about right there, 90 degrees, like a like a traditional single joint does. Look at that. Look at how his uh, his top is like frayed and kind of like really damaged and um worn and weathered. That looks really good though. Hey, yo, check his hands out ashy larry if y'all know who ashy larry is look at dave chappelle look up dave chappelle i mean google dave chappelle ashy larry and you'll see why i said ashy larry at these hands look at that man but so much detail though man you gotta love that little whitewash on there that's pretty good stuff now um we're all wondering does this top come off it probably does but it may be more the one i'm willing to do right now uh but it looks good though check this out are these like actually no okay so he has a red shirt underneath now i'm pretty sure this top does come off but it looks like it's going to be oof, pretty challenging so you customizers out there have your work cut out for you because this top it, i mean i'm sure it does come off somehow some way but it's not going to come off easily um one thing another thing i want to point out i want you guys to notice the so his his top is smooth and soft right here but as you get down to the tips of his top like the tips right here it's hard like can you listen I'm not sure if you guys can hear that if the microphone is picking it up but the tips of his suit are like hard 
like uh i can best describe it as like dry glue it's like somebody put glue on his on the bottom of his top it dried up and then they just cut it that's what that feels like if you're wondering because i know it's hard it, it doesn't really translate that well over into the video but that is like it's like a dry glue kind of feel check out his red scarf underneath right there it doesn't pull back any further than that now as far as his waist articulation let's check that out look how we moving we're moving good we are moving good. He's got that cousin Eddie from like Adam's Family vibe. We are moving good. What's his name? Eddie from Adam's Family? I don't know. Whatever his name was. It was the one guy where he had the short neck and the big shoulders. That dude right there from Adam's Family. That's who Nas reminds me of. So waist articulation is looking like that. That's looking pretty good. So again, no matter where his victims go, they go left, they go right. Nas is getting them. If they're bending over though, if they bend over, Nas can't get them. So if you dug down too low, Nas can't bite you. But if you go back a lot, like if you dip on him, like you know, like if you go that way, uh, he might be able to get you, but not too good. All right, so we're going left and right, just a little bit of tilt, a lot of bit of rotation there, a lot of bit right there, but it's front and back, like that, like not too much. If you can see that, not too much. Okay, left and right, a tiny, tiny bit. Okay, all right, moving on down to the spandex yoga pants. Yoga pants are in. My man got a flat booty. <laughs> <laughs> yoga pants are in and this is what his yoga pants look like okay his tights they look like that all right so we're gonna wonder we're wondering are the knees double jointed dun, 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 dun. they are knees are double jointed all right so what does that mean for you as a dynamic poser what that means is when Nas is running after his victims it doesn't matter how fast they're going because he's going to still catch them with those fancy, smancy, double jointed knees. What kind of running pose is that? Hold on, I can do way better. I could do way better. Here it is. Hey, 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 there we go. How's that for a running pose? How about we pose him like that, running, and he put his arm out like he's trying to grab his victim. There it is. Who's my next victim? Blah, blah, blah. I don't know what Nas sounds like, man. That's like my Dracula impersonation, though. But anyway, let's keep it moving. All right. So again, no bicep swivel. All of your rotation is going to come from the forearm. All right. The forearm, which starts like right there. OK, so moving on down the line, check out his shoes. What are those? These are your sneakers, your creepers. You're getting them in the middle of the night. I'm coming up on you. You're not going to hear me. Look at that. This joint feels uh, very sensitive though, so be careful when you move this. Um, we're not going in and out that much, but we are going up and down a lot. And look at the detail on the shoes, look at the wrinkles, the crinkles, all that kind of good stuff right there. And the bottom is shiny. Interesting. Okay, so we got a ton, a ton, like a hundred accessories to go over. Not a hundred, I'm exaggerating, but we got a lot of accessories to go over with Nas. Okay, so. You know how I do it. We put Nas right there. The first layer of accessories. Because, you know, Mez will be hitting y'all with all those accessories, man. The heat. I'm going to show y'all the first level of accessories. All right. Well, first, we have a couple of faces we need to look at here. Here is the, oh, my goodness. Oh, my good. Wow. The, okay. Um, I, I haven't seen anybody use this head in a photo yet. Um, and I'm in all the groups and maybe I'm just out of touch, but man, this is like being scorched by the sun right here. Dang. And look at his grill. His teeth are all messed up. Oof, man, this face is fire. Like it's literally fire though. Like the sun just got him like that face. All right. Oof, I can't even get, wow. That was, that was amazing looking. All right. Anyway, next up, oh, full blown suck your blood mode. Look at that. Look how far his mouth is stretched out. Full blown suck your blood. Look at the difference between calm Nas and suck your blood Nas. Dang, homie. Look how his nose like flared up and got out the way for the bite. They gave him like a bat nose on that one. My goodness. All right, whew, what we got here? Oh, we have a, a nice hat from the 19th century that Nas can wear on his little egg head. Looks like that. Huh, looks interesting. I like that though. 
like da, 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 like that. Like I don't know why, but it makes me think about that for some odd reason. Um, let's see. We have a couple of hands. Boom, 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 and various different poses. And one of the most interesting things we have here: rats. Uh, one, two, three, four, six to be exact, in different poses. Also, let's get a close up at these rats. Let's just get one out of here. One of these rats, mice, whatever. Look at these bad boys. Even they have like a lot of detail <laughs> and nice little paint apps. Paint apps on the rats. Check out his lantern. Or, oh, I broke it. I didn't break it. You just hook it right back in like that. This is soft, flexible plastic right there. But still, like always, man, you don't want to manhandle and gorilla handle all these things here. But this is his lantern or lantern, lantern, lantern with some stained glass um, all around it. That's good, man. Oh, let's go. Always hitting us with the dope accessories. The next layer of accessories. Oh, we got a big. We have a smoke cloud. Okay. We have a smoke cloud. This is interesting, and I'll show you why that's cool in a second. I'm going to tell you what's so dope about a smoke cloud. The next layer of accessories. And I'm literally just opening it. Oh, I dropped, I dropped one of the. Um, one of the good things it's a bat we have then we have a special guest appearance by the batman there he is right here and the cool thing about these bats is that you could take this smoke cloud right here and the bats actually fit in the smoke cloud like so you see that so we have three bats and we have three spots for the bats on this smoke cloud right here it's just like a little plastic -y. listen like See what I mean? That's just a little little plasticky little effect right there. Like it's cool. Nothing too um great. Um check out the bats. Did I get a close-up of the bats? Look at the bats. Look at that. My man comes with a lot of animals. Maybe he's a pet lover. He's an animal lover. You gotta love Nas. Nas loves the animals, but what I couldn't wait to get to. Oh, ho, ho. yeah, man. Yeah, man. These right here. The wolves. Dang, homie. Oh, look, he's got some battle damage right there on his butt, on his behind. But look at the browns and the blacks. Look how shiny that fur is. Look at those green eyes. Look at that. He's got some battle damage on his face, his body. He's got a chunk of flesh missing right there. Mish mission. Well, blah, 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 blah. Mush mouth. Too bad these legs don't move, though, or their tail doesn't. Like, nothing is articulated here. But look at that. Look at that grill. Dang. And I wonder, I wonder if these eyes glow. All right, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta test it out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this wolf, put it in the light real quick. All right, now let's see if the eyes glow. Let's see. You see any glow in there? Nah, I don't think the eyes glow. I could be wrong. Maybe I should charge it for longer, but I could be wrong. But the eyes do not appear to be glowing. Now here is our second wolf. Look at that. Oh, it's a black one. And he is in a different pose still with the lime green eyes, the battle damage on his back leg, his hind leg. He's in a creeping kind of pose. He is down low. More battle damage right there. Look at the fur though. Like this, oh, the paint and sculpt. Like this is just pure sculpt right here. The fur is like, it's just pure sculpt. It looks real good. Let's put these bad boys next to each other. Look at that. Guard dogs guard dogs look at these things man oh my gosh they look so good oh <laughs> i know y'all like dang dante calm down dude do you understand how good those look all right let's put those away all right um believe it or not believe it or not you know how masco does it dude there is one more layer of accessories i kid you not you think i'm joking but i kid you not here it is man we have let's crack it open come on come on come on what is this we have our stand we have our mezgo baggie for all your accessories they're gonna you're gonna fill it all the way up with all your accessories we have our logo stand right there um, and we have the cape or the cloak whatever you want to call this bad boy we got one for nas let's see get out of there this thing is thick too and look at the bottom of this just like his shirt or just like his top, the bottom of this is also dirty. Like it's been, like it's been dragging around the dirt and the mud, you know, things like that. And um, here's the top right here. 
it is not wired we got some like soft nylon -y material on the inside and like that softer felt on the outside um we have some velcro right here to go around his neck and oh it just comes right off did i break that oh no it comes right off there's some velcro right there and some velcro right there so it just goes back together and let's see this is wired across there right there and this is wired like that so to give you guys an idea and i'm done with y'all man i'm gonna let y'all go and have the rest of y'all eat in the back or whatever whenever you're watching this so but i just want to give y'all a quick look at how this is on nas let's just stick his body inside there da, da, da. come on egghead i guess i should pop the things off first i didn't want to do that though but I'll, I'll pop them off. There it is. One and two. I'll pop them off. I'll put Nas in there. Come on. And then I'll just, I'll pop on one. Because I don't want to bore y'all with me fiddling around with like buttons and such. But he's going to look like that. And here's the top part of it. Let's get this stuff out the way. Because that doesn't look professional, does it? <laughs> Let's get all this stuff in like that. Did I just see some a hole? I saw a hole. Look at that. I guess his hands are going to stick through that. That's cool. But this is how he looks. He is completely covered. Like, you can't even see this guy right now. Like, his body. And then, of course, you put that on. And he's like, ooh, nothing but the creepy, scary red eyes right there. That's it. That's it. All right. So whoa man this has been a lot of accessories from nas but you guys tell me man i like it i think it's dope right i'm gonna give nas mm, mm, maybe maybe eight seven and a half eight stars only because the articulation is limited right there and i'm an articulation fiend can't go back and forth that too you know too far but i'm gonna give nas like a solid eight stars though man but, but he's good though he is good. Wait a minute. Are one of my legs shorter than the other? It looks weird. Let me stand them up. Are one of my legs shorter than the other? Oh, it's not. Okay, cool. All right, guys. I'm out of here. And girls, I'm done. You guys have a good one. See you.